Hey guys, I'm Um, I don't know, but today you are watching my edit of Strange World. It's been 12 days since I originally um, did the, you know, or not 12 days, Um, it's been like about 14, I want to say. Um, 14 days since I, you know, actually, you know, did the v the video and it's been 14 days I it's been 13 days since I've edited it down to a reasonable amount and try my best to go past through YouTube's you know bam hammer of a copyright system but it didn't work <clears throat> so this is the final production of me editing my own video it was gonna be my cousin but she has not gone back to me yet about it but if she ha if she does by the time this comes up then ignore this this will probably be deleted but if it hasn't just know that I was waiting for her I was being very patient I gave it to her as soon as I was done editing it down and in my view of what needs to be edited down um but you know YouTube and that stuff thinks everything is it's not yours but anyway um I tried waiting um, and I'm getting a little bit impatient now it's been almost like a whole like two weeks since I've wanted to get this out to you guys as soon as possible and for some weird reason I'm wearing the exact same shirt well the same flannel shirt I'm not wearing the same like undershirt but I'm wearing the exact same shirt of flannel as I did in the video so was this intentional? No, no it wasn't. This was completely by accident. So, you're gonna watch me weeks after when I was still in New York in my grandfather's office recording the video, okay? Um, but, uh, let me know what you thought of my edit and if I get the chance to get my cousin's edit, maybe I'll upload it, maybe I won't. It depends on, on the quality of the video, you know, because I also have to see how the quality of that be because I want all my videos to be like you know good quality and stuff like that but um yeah I hope you guys enjoyed remember if my cousin gives me the video in the next couple of days or in the next week then I can publish this publish that and delete this but if not this is what you get and I hope you are satisfied with this because it it's, it's been a long time that I want you guys to watch this and it's a pretty good it's a pretty good movie that I want to push be pushed more out in the world of just grandparents supporting their ch grandchild no matter who or what they love or who they are so yeah um make sure you like and subscribe remember patreon is down below where you see this video way before it was even edited it's a full length reaction and you can have it early access and I have all these other movies that I have in mind that will be coming soon. So yeah, make sure you stick for that. And tomorrow is the first day of um, 10 episodes worth of The Last of Us, a TV series. And I'll get all into that when we get there but I just want to let you know that I am doing a series on this so let me know what you guys think of that um remember patreon down below where you get the early access to that you know you can get it early and in full version so win win um but yeah I'll see you guys later go over to uh past Maddie peace hey guys I'm -D -D -Y. I don't know but today we are here with a new movie from Disney called Strange World. Now, I have never seen this. I have heard of it. I've seen clips of it on TikTok. But when it first like released or like first announced, I wasn't really all for it. I was like, oh, great, another Disney movie. <laughs> you should be like, oh, great, another Disney movie. I want to go see it with my family. Don't want to go see it with my family. <laughs> I don't know. Disney movies have been weird for me. I don't know why. But it's just been, I don't know, it's the same, like, formula, like, lost parent, found parent, you know, missing parent, I don't know. They have a thing with parents, apparently. <laughs>
Eh, eh, okay, never mind. But um, we're gonna watch this today. Um, if you guys want the full length reaction, make sure to check, check out my Patreon. That's where you get the full uncut reaction to stuff like this. And you get to vote. If I have enough Patreon users, you guys get to vote on what I watch next instead of me parading the interwebs of what's popular right now. So, yeah. Let's go on to Strange Worlds. Full length this is on Patreon. Link is down below. Whoa. The hell? This is new. Whoa! 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 Is this the new intro? Wow. A hundred years? It has been really a hundred years? Wow. Welcome explorers to Avalonia. Avalonia? Civilization trapped behind an impassable ring of never-ending mountains. Whose okay. citizens strive to do their best despite their humble means. Many have tried to get past them. All have failed. But hope mm. has arrived as Avalonia's greatest explorers, the Clades, have now set their sights the on pulling off the impossible. Meet Jaeger Clade. Jaeger Clade. The one and only. And who's this by his side? Why, it's none other than his bouncing baby boy, Searcher. Mm -hmm. Together, these two are destined to finally find a route through these impassable peaks. Ooh. You're interested in plants, right? I wouldn't touch it though. Whoa. Don't touch it. What are you doing? Don't touch it! I what did I just say? <laughs> Another close call, hey searcher. Do you see that everyone? They'll be telling our story for generations to come. For what lies beyond that horizon is Avalonia's future and our glory. Hey, Dad, what about these plants? There's literally power surging through them. Searcher, I do love your inquisitive spirit, but our crew didn't come all this way just to get distracted by some sparkly plants. But our crew did come out here to make a discovery that could change Avalonia, right? The discovery our crew is looking for is on the other side of these mountains. Because that's Avalonia's future. But if our crew would just take a look at these plants, oh, they could see that Avalonia's future might be right here. <laughs> this crew has been training since they were a baby to do one thing. Cartography. Nope. And that one thing nope. is to walk with BB. That's what they really wanted? Oh, they're not really talking about the crew, are they? Search no! You think Baby Clay's right? No, this do Yeah, you're, we don't actually know what's past the mountains. But these plants here are real. We owe it to Avalonia to see what they can do. Here, you'll need this to find your way home. What? Wait! I just walked out like that. Let me guess, you never came back, did he? 25 years ago. Yeah, yep, got my answer. Got my answer. Yo, this <laughs> is the first image that has to be imprinted on my brain this morning. Yes, yes, it is. <gasps> it bothers him? Mm. Okay, okay. You know, I hope you know that you're emotionally scarred, Legend. Mm -hmm. He looks real upset. So upset. Looks like someone forgot to weed the North Field. Father, what is a weed other than a plant growing somewhere that you find inconvenient? Ah, I appreciate how clever you are. But you know what I'd appreciate more? If I weeded the North Field. If you weeded the North Field. <gasps> He's a three-legged dog! Oh my god, I love him even more! Hmm. Candle batteries 
dead. That doesn't make any sense. I picked those pots an hour ago. That uh, pest must be getting in the root system again. Well, I'll give our field some extra love as soon as I get the duster back in the air. Hey, the crew's here. Ethan's crew, not your crew. Yeah, but his friends love me. No, we talked about this. Ethan's a teenager. Boundaries. Yeah, yeah, boundaries. Boundaries. Got it. <sighs> just came back from the game shop. The special edition of Primal Outpost just dropped. They sold out in 15 minutes. What? They sold out already? Oh, I knew I should have camped out. Don't worry. We didn't forget about you. Oh. <gasps> hey, Diazo. Ooh, do we like Diazo? Notice why I just, uh, he was just, uh, what's up? Just what? Hey, <clears throat> what's up? Hi. So, work this morning, so I made sure we grabbed you a pack. You did? That's, Aww. that's really sweet. Ugh, okay. Stuff. Farmer. Uh, here, I'll trade you. This one feels more Ethan to me. An explorer. Except for. Ah, gay love. Oh, no. What are you doing? Oh, that sucks. Not all the time. All the time. On occasion. So, Diazo, tell me about yourself. Nah, that's not really necessary. Are you into farming? Because Ethan is an amazing farmer. You should see him out there. He's strong, smart, super cool, or as you kids say, so true. deep. No, don't say, oh, wow. don't say okay. don't we have to Can we change the subject? Sorry guys, we gotta go now. Apologies at my dad. So dad. Bye. You know, I bet your dad would be really proud of everything you've accomplished. <laughs> hey, you clearly don't know anything about your grandpa. I mean I would if you ever talked about him. Hmm. Dad, he's my grandfather. I wanna know about him. From you. Everyone thinks the Jaeger Clade is this amazing hero, but that's only because they didn't have him as a father. To me, he was just a really bad dad. And he didn't care about me, he only cared about conquering those mountains. And I only care about you, our family, and our farm. Well, I guess that's what makes you a pretty good dad. Wait, what was that? Oh, nothing. Mm -hmm. nothing. Mm -hmm. What was that? My mouth and no words no, came out. No, no, Actually, no, 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 no. Words came out. Words came out. You said I'm a really good dad. Pretty good. Pretty good. My son thinks I'm an amazing dad. <laughs> <laughs> Baby Clay. Hey. How long has it been? Callisto? You know her? Yeah, she used to work with my dad. What is the leader of Avalonia doing in our front yard? Uh -huh. I'll get it. Uh, can the venture fly over the mountains? <laughs> well, sorry, nothing can fly that high. There's something I need to show you. Where did you find these? It started in the Northeast Territory, and it's been spreading like wildfire ever since. According to our estimates, every crop will be infected within a month, including your farm. Though Pando seems to be thousands of plants here on the surface, underground, it is actually a singular organism with an interconnected root system. We believe whatever's making Pando sick is attacking it deep within this system at its heart. Three weeks ago, Captain Falkir tracked the roots out to the Atlas Range, where they suddenly took a turn downward. They started excavating, but the ground gave out, revealing an even bigger mystery. Our mission is to follow these roots until we reach the heart of Pando and stop whatever's harming it. Oh, so how far does it go down? We're not sure. But Avalonia's future depends on us finding out. Searcher! What? Meridian? What are you doing down here? I've been trying to flag you down for the last four hours. Our son is on your ship! What is she saying? She said your son is on our ship. Hey, Mom! Ethan? Oh, hey, Dad. <laughs> Legend! Dog! What, what are you doing here? Look, Dad, I just want to help. Ethan, we talked about this. I can't. I need you to take care of the farm while I'm gone. Now, please, go home with Mom. Wait, but Dad... What the heck is that? What is happening, Dad? What are those things? Head inside. I got this. They're like pterodactyls, but like glow-in-the-dark pterodactyls. What the fuck?
the hell? Oh! Legend! Go, 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 go! Oh, go! Oh, go! Oh, go! Oh, go! Oh, go! I'm a human being from the top world. You probably don't understand a word I'm saying, do you? Of course I understand you. What do you think I am, one of those mindless monsters? Huh? That's right, Bob. You're in the presence of the one, the only, Jaeger. Dad? Dad? Probably just some oddly shaped rock that my eyes want to believe is a person. But I am not an oddly shaped rock. That's exactly what an oddly shaped rock would say. Wow. Okay, well, would an oddly shaped rock know that you gave me a machete for my birthday? <laughs> Classic Jaeger claimed. I was too. Hmm. I'm real, Dad. It's really me. This is incredible. I was thinking the same. Hmm? Uh, oh. <laughs> Hug. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that means that flying machine that crashed is also real? Yeah. Well, let's get moving. We've got no time to lose. Whoa, wait. Oh. Um, Mrs. Clade? Yeah, what's up? Remember how I was given the crucial responsibility of watching your son? Oh, has he given you trouble? Just send him back to me. I'll put him to work. Oh, I would love to do that, except I don't know where he is. What? You had one job. One job. Oh, do you even know how to drive a thing? Way faster than our tractor. Way faster. <laughs> What is your whole plan here, anyway? That is... That is actually very pretty. <laughs> pretty. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You know what those things remind me of? In Spy Kids 3, what Junie rides? That reminds me of it. Oh, that is, uh... Tongue? Okay, Ethan, 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 Ethan! You okay? I would not go in there. I would try to climb. I would so try to climb. I would not go in there. You can do this, Ethan. Just be brave. It's in your blood. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm alive. Yeah. Looks like a Nickelodeon splat. That is so weird, but also kind of cool. Yeah. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. I'm friendly. See? I'm a friend. See? We're all friends. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I guess I deserve that. I did splat you into a wall. Hey, that's my dad's. Where'd you get that? What? Can you bring me to him? I'm so lucky I ran into you. By the way, you're not dangerous, right? I mean, you don't look dangerous, I just, you know. I have so many questions, like, for one, what is this place? A subterranean labyrinth where everything's alive. And most things, well, they want to eat you. Uh, you, you mean like this thing? No, that's harmless. And, and these things? Funny little goobers, aren't they? Every time I blaze a trail, they unblaze it. Right. Um, so how did you even end up down here? 
through ingenuity and sheer tenacity. After months of battling the elements, I figured there was no way anyone could ever survive walking over those cold, deadly peaks. I went searching for a new path. I found this place. Oh, so you're stuck down here. I, uh, I, I wouldn't put it that way. How would you put it then? I found this place, and it occurred to me, instead of going over these mountains, I'll go under them. That is, until I came upon the Burning Sea. A place where the cliffs are alive, and the waters will dissolve the flesh off your bones. But now, with that flying machine of yours, we got a way to fly right past it and onto the other side of the mountains. Wait, we literally discovered a world beneath our world, and that's not enough? This discovery may be fine for some second-class explorers, but not for us clades. Whoa there, this clade is not an explorer. This clade is a farmer. A farmer? Oh, your mom has a lot of explaining to do. She's, she's 60 and works out five days a week. I said she was gone, as in moved on, with Sheldon. 25 years, Dad. We thought you were dead for 25 years. What did you think was gonna happen? Honestly. Searcher, you call that climbing? I'm a 40-year-old man that farms. Climbing isn't really part of my day today. So, you just forgot everything I taught you? No, just the pointless explorer stuff. So, yeah, everything. Well, skunk all you want, but when I get past these mountains, I'll return to Avalonia a hero. Bet they even give me a statue in the town square. You already have a statue. I do? Yeah, and it's right beside mine. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you have a statue. What, do they just give statues to everybody these days? No, Dad, I discovered Panda. You know, the thing I'm actually down here to save. The discovery that actually changed the world and transformed Avalonia into the utopia that it is today. And the whole humble farmer bit, huh? I created a real legacy. What? Whoa! Oh, okay there. Uh, is this thing dangerous? Maybe. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, maybe don't follow Splat? Whoa. What is this thing? Hey, we're still looking for my dad, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know, but this pando fell off the venture and we don't waste the pods, so I'm just gonna grab it really quick, okay? Hang on, hang on, really quick, just let me grab the rest of these. What? What? Trust me. Come on. I want to make it all better. Come on. Come on. There you go. Oh, here, here. Oh, it's, okay. It's, okay. it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. There you go. All better. Good as new. Are these friends of yours? Uh, hi. Hi. I, I uh, thought Splat here was bringing me to my dad. Uh, maybe I was wrong. <laughs> I don't see my dad anywhere. I'll just be on my way. Whoa! Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. No, Ethan! Dad! Stay behind me. Who's he? Ethan, meet your grandpa. That's Jaeger Clade? The one and only. <laughs> now what, Joe? <laughs> My life! You know, I was a part of that rescue too. He just saved your life! You ain't seen nothing yet, kid. <laughs> Get on! Pretty mom! Oh no no no, don't you mom me! Oh yeah, you're in trouble. Oh, I like her. Who's he? My dad. What? Hurry up! I know, oh, just go, just go. Great idea, Splat! Splat? Its name is Splat? 
so cute. It actually is. Don't merchandise it. I think Dizzy already covered you. Here I come. Okay, that's not what we're here to do. Oh, right. Your silly little plan. It is not silly. Fine. Your boring little plan. You know what I find it's not boring? boring. Your terrible comeback. What? No. Ugh. You. Oh, clever. Okay, adult speaking here. Searcher's right. The mission is to get to Pando's heart. Because hmm. as we can all see, we are on a clock. But after we do that, there's nothing stopping us from continuing on to the other side of the mountains. Sound like a fair deal? <laughs> Lucky flannel, baby! Lucky flannel up in this business. Up in the business. So fluffy. Can we actually touch her? That's so cool. <laughs> hey, get out of here! Come on, get, 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 ha, shoot! So you're my grandson, huh? Yep. That's the rumor. Well, tell me about yourself, Ethan. What are you into? Fighting? Hunting? Any sweethearts waiting for you back home, huh? Ah, there it is. <laughs> Who is it? Uh, it's no one. Uh -uh. Diazzo. His name is Diazzo. Diazzo, huh? I really like him a lot. I just don't know how to tell him because I just get this. I always get so this. Hey, let your grandpa give you some solid advice. If you really, really want to impress this fella, this is what you do. He's supportive. He's from a time not on his own, but he's supportive. Why can't all grandparents be like this? Just fucking supportive. Bonus points if it includes bandits, alligators, and or spectacular explosions. A really toxic way to start a relationship. Not to mention crazy dangerous. Dangerous? Ha, you're a clade. We love danger. Go ahead. Give it a try. <laughs> uh, really? Okay. Ah! <laughs> oh yeah, that's a clay boy right there. <laughs> Pando Schmidt. <-man. laughs> hey, Dad. Um, I really appreciate you bonding with Ethan here, but maybe a flamethrower isn't his thing. <laughs> I appreciate that you think that, but maybe Ethan doesn't know his thing. Oh no, they're doing the same thing. So they're doing the same Go ahead, kiddo. <laughs> Um, what's happening here? I don't know. Oh, he asked for help. Oh, that was nice. That's nice. Awesome. Bye. That was nice. <laughs> so glad we're not dead. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, not these things again. It's okay. I got a better weapon. Aim at center mass! Wow. wow. You suck at this. You how to throw? Sheldon? Oh, this is how you throw. Center your weight. Breathe in. Focus. And follow through. <laughs> See? It's all in the follow through. Alright? Your turn. Okay. Center, Center weight. weight. Breathe. Focus. And follow through. There you go. <laughs> now take him up. Set it up. Come on, pops. There you go. <laughs> you ain't nothing against the clades. Father, son, Bonnie time. Not too bad for a farmer, right? Yeah, not too bad at all. Huh. Look at that. They're finally getting along. <laughs> About time, right? Yeah, especially since they're basically the same person. Mm, don't let your father hear you say that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you want to take the wheel? I'm dying for a cup of coffee. Wait, really? Yeah, just follow the roots. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. If only Diazzo could see you now. Huh? What? You don't think your dad and I talk? <laughs> You're doing great. Yeah. Just watch out! <laughs> 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 
Oh god! Oh, I thought you were tickling. I thought I thought you were kidding. Okay, never mind. Ooh. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Uh, my bad. We're all good. <laughs> never seen you so happy as you are down here. I guess. Yeah, I just the farm is so small. The world is so big. I just feel like I'm in my element. I don't know. Hmm. What? Why are you looking at me like I'm that? I'm not looking at you. Um, please don't make it weird. I'm not looking at you. weird. We gave birth to you. <laughs> We've got rights. Yeah. I'd <laughs> like to exercise my right to stare at you. Uncomfortable. <laughs> no, you have to focus on the road. You have to look at the road. You're driving. Oh, calm down. I'm just saying you should keep exploring those feelings. Might just lead you down some interesting paths. Mm hmm. Oh, it heals it. That's cool. Makes sense. Pando seems to be getting stronger the deeper we go. If Pando is dying, shouldn't it be getting weaker? President Ball, the Reapers are here, and they brought friends. What? Meridian, go! They didn't attack us. But why didn't they attack us? It might have something to do with that. What are they doing? Well, they're doing what any pest would do. They're trying to dig into Pando's heart and devour it from the inside. It's fighting for its life out there. That's why our plants are dying up top. Pando's rerouting all its energy to protect itself right here. Our plant's not sick. It's protecting... It's at war. Our thing, Ethan. Father and son. It just doesn't feel right to me. I don't want to kill all these creatures. Me neither. Well, don't think of it as killing. We're just uh, exterminating some pests, trying to destroy our crops. I know you, Ethan. And this isn't you. Are you crazy? Hey, get on this skiff now. Leave me alone. Hey, what is this all about? You, Dad! You! Me? You just assume I'll follow in your footsteps, but you never ask me what I wanted! You're a kid! You don't know what you want! I know I don't want to be you! Sounds familiar? My whole life, I worked so hard to be the exact opposite of my dad. And, uh, looks like I ended up just like him. I just wanted so badly to build you a legacy you could be proud of. Might have got a little bit caught up in it. Dad, stop talking. Ethan, I'm trying to apologize Dude, here. Dad. Stop talking. That's blue sky. Is it a giant animal? Like the the bender. Turtles from Avatar. That's an eye, right? Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. A, a really, really big eye. Uh huh. Yeah. You, you know what this means, right? It's judging me. No, no. <laughs> if this place has an eye, it has to be attached to a head. And if this place has a head. That means what we've been traveling through this entire time was its insides. Like its guts and stuff? Okay, yes. Hear me out. The windy force that we were in? That's the lungs. And, and the acid lake? That's the stomach! And this giant eye must be its eye. It's eye! eye. I the know! Monsters. They're an immune system. What? That's what Splat was trying to tell me. This place... It's alive. It's alive. It's a living thing. We didn't find the heart of Pando. We, we found, found the heart. heart of the creature. So, all this time, we've been living on the back of this giant creature? Yeah. And Pando is killing it. Uh, you have to turn this ship around. I'm sorry, what? Mission's over. This place is not what it seems. 
Is there a problem? Big problem. Listen, Ethan and I got into a huge fight. So I jumped off the ship. You jumped off the ship? What do you say? We'll, we'll get to there. We'll get there. The next thing we know, we're on the other side of the mountains. What? Staring directly at a, a giant, giant creature. creature. What? A giant creature. You can't be serious. Okay, listen. This place, this world that we live on, is a living thing, and Pando is killing it. If we want to survive, Pando has to go. What? what? You want us to destroy Pando? <laughs> Callisto? Dad? Callisto? Get hands off me. Emotions are running really high right now. And I don't know what you think you saw, but we came down here to save Pando. That plan hasn't changed. You have no idea what you're doing. You are going to destroy Avalonia! Please, you gotta listen to me! You're making a big mistake. You gotta get us out of here. Unlock this door. What are you doing? I'm trying to see outside. <gasps> Legend! Legend! Hey, boy. Hey, Hi open the door. Boy. Can you open the door? Open the door. Come on, Legend. Open the door, Legend. Can you open the door? Can you be a good boy and, and, and open the door? Can you not yell? Not yell. I wouldn't yell if you were actually trained. He is trained. He hasn't been in the house for the last two days. We've been on this ship for the last two days. We still have to unlock it. There's a switch right beside the handle. Legend, you see the switch? You see the switch, boy? Can you make it green? What is that sound? Is he he's licking looking, the switch? I think he's yeah, licking the switch. Stop <laughs> licking the switch. Stop licking the switch. There you go. Good boy, Legend! Thank you, Splat. Okay. What's the plan? Let's get back control of this ship. The Pando defenses are keeping those creatures from destroying it from the inside. But if I can dig a hole for them... They can take care of the rest. I'll keep Callisto off your back. And you keep our son safe out there. Wait, what? He is not coming with me. <laughs> Tell him that. Hey, you coming or what? We're on the clock. We're right there, where all the roots converge. If the Reapers attack that, the rest of the plant will crumble. <laughs> You and Splat round up every creature you can, and you send them my way. I'll do the rest. You got it, Dad. And Ethan, I'm sorry if I ever made you think that you had to be a farmer to make me proud. I'm always proud of you. I know, Dad. I know. Let go of those controls. Okay. Ah! Grab the controls. Put them on. Take them off. Put them on. Take them off. Make them. <laughs> <laughs> Good boy, legend. Hey guys, remember me? Keep digging.
that pump in through the how Ah, oh, they're red blood cells! I, I didn't catch that! They're red blood cells! Those flat things are white blood cells! I don't know what those dinosaur looking things with the things on the back are, but. Oh, Splat! Bye, Splat! Bye! Yeah, they're white blood cells! I spent my whole life wondering about this moment. What it be like? What it look like? What it feel like? Feels perfect. <laughs> One year later, Dad from Ethan. Dear Dad, though it's been an incredibly challenging year. <laughs> It's inspiring to see how resilient people can be. We can be resourceful. Show? We can surprise. Yeah, show then. <laughs> though we can't live like we did in the past, we've now given ourselves a better chance at a future. Aww. We're not quite there yet, but we will be. Because the best legacy we can leave is making a present worth opening tomorrow. I'll do my best to live up to your legacy. I hope I make you proud. Love always, your son. at all I thought huh wow okay I'm gonna lower this that's a little bit loud wow okay so the so-called miracle as it were right the so-called miracle that they found was actually the problem and their home being on the back of a legit turtle what I mean like Wow, that was so cool, and like the whole thing, like being his legit insides, like, wow, that's, it's, that's amazing, ah, the visuals, where do I start with the visuals, that was, oh my god, that was so beautiful, all the visuals and stuff like that. Oh, and I love the LGBTQ, you know, showing off there with the sun, like, in the, the cute guy. And I see why he likes the cute guy, I'm just saying. But the, what, the thing that I love the most is the grandpa, when he asks, is there a special someone... Oops, sorry, not the can. Is there a special someone waiting for you on the surface? And he said yes, and then, then he said... Well, his name is blah 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 and I really like him but when I talk to him and I'm like no oh, this and like that and then him just accepting it and giving him some advice some bad advice but some advice nonetheless it's like why can't my grandparents be like that I can't when I say I am now a boy why can't they just accept that you know why do I have to you know now, now it's, since it's a new year, I'm recording this on New Year's Day, 2023. Happy New Year's, everyone, by the way. Um, I have my resolution to to let people know that I am a he. I am a he, through and through, no she, even though my voice predicts it and my some of my body parts depicted when I stand up. Sometimes when I'm sitting down, it looks like I'm, I'm a, just an overweight guy, but sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes if I wear my binder, I do, but uh, right now I'm not wearing my binder because I want to be comfortable by watching a movie in a house <laughs> that I don't own. <laughs> but, like, why can't adults just accept us for who we are? Why does their religion have to make them 
people that we don't really recognize, you know? Like, me and my grandfather have a really good relationship. Me and my grandmother have a really good relationship. But be beside that, they don't respect my pronouns. And that's the thing that kills me. Every time I hear she, 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 when, the, when, when th talking about me, I'm like, no, no, no. And before, I'm doing this, now it's a new year, so I'm doing something different. But before, I'm like, here we go again. But this time, I'm going to stand my ground. I'm going to make myself more of an adult and more get more courage for myself. And just, I'm just going to, you know, I'm just going to say, no, nope. I'm a guy. I'm a man. I go by he, him. I go to the men's bathroom except when I'm on my menstrual cycle. I'm gonna stop calling it the P word because it, it is a P word, but um, I'm gonna call it a menstrual cycle. I still go on my menstrual cycle. I'm currently on my menstrual cycle. I'm on the midway of my menstrual cycle if I'm cal calculating correctly, but I never do. It happens and then it stops when it stops. I don't know. It, it comes and goes, basically. I don't keep track of it. But I have menstrual cycles. I wear pads. But I am still a man. I still go to men's restrooms. I still wear men's clothing. I still go to the men's aisle in the shirts and, and pants and underwear department. Unless it's my menstrual cycle, then I go to the women and get some panties. But otherwise... I am a man. If you don't like it, fuck off. This is not a kid's channel. I am who I am, and no one can say anything different. If you have a problem, I don't care. Honestly, I don't give a fuck. But say it in my face, and then we have, we'll have something to talk about. We'll have something to talk about. Because I am, I am done playing the nice guy. I am really done. I just want to be appreciated for once in my life. Everyone else is so appreciative of me, but I don't know. So, so it's those those leeches that that go grab on your heart and start affecting your body and affecting your body. I I now need to dig a hole so my innards can just those attachments can just fuck right off. I want to be close to them. Yes, I still want to be close to them. But their toxicity, their latch on a person that's no longer here. Of a girl. Of... Do I have a picture? Oh, yes. Actually, this is better. This is better. Because I'm actually wearing a dress in here. Of this, this little girl, she is no more. Do I miss being this little girl? No. God, no. I do not miss being this little girl because this little girl was scared to be herself. She was scared to be herself. And now, this little girl doesn't have to because this young man can be brave for her. She's not here anymore, but I want to try to make her proud. I really do. I'm wearing a blue dress in this photo. A blue mini dress. Compromising, am I right? I look at these pictures of me when I was a literal baby. Look at that. And I think, wow. This little girl. Look at her. Look how happy she is. You can see the difference in happiness, actually, in these two photos. Me in a blue dress and me just being me.
don't know. But what I do know is that I love my grandparents very, very much. But I wish they can just see me. Say, hey, he's a, he's a guy. Why not treat him like one, you know? I know New Yorkers are hard asses, but still. It'd be nice if being appreciated was on their to-do list. By the way, enough me rambling about myself and my priorities. We're talking about the movie. The movie was great. I love it. I really do. I really love it. Watch this again with my family, see how they feel. I like the whole, the kid wanting to be helpful around his environment instead of like playing it to fit his own agenda. I really do like that. Ethan, right? I love, he, Ethan's like my favorite character. That and Splat, and Legend, of course Legend, the three-legged dog. <sighs> leave, me, leave me your comments down below of what you guys thought of my reaction and this movie. Um, make sure to check out the full-length reaction that is on Patreon. See you guys next time. This has been MTA to DDY. I don't know, but I really like this movie. If I get it one out of ten Mickey Mouses, I would give it, a, a, honestly, a 9.5. You know, the point five is because it's an ideal world. It's not real. God, I wish that was real. If I lived in that, 